Howdy friends, welcome to our day. It might just be my day. I might only have me in it today because my new purse came in. My new purse! Okay, I have to be honest, I didn't wait till I got my fetch points. <laughs> I'm so close. I will use that um, Amazon gift card in the future for the family. We'll like balance out. I was so excited the other day when I was at the grocery store because someone left their receipt behind and I promise you I don't do anything with the other information. Like you only get the last digit so the credit card anyway, but I scanned it and it was worth 2,000 points. I was so close, but I'm not. I'm like 250 points away, but I went ahead and ordered the purse because I also needed to get some things for my daughter's birthdays and I'm a planner and I just, once I know I need to get stuff, I went ahead and put in a whole order. Okay, so two things came so far, my purse and a new cell phone case, which I'm gonna show you here in a second. Um, my husband thinks I'm nuts because I kind of get bored with my cases and so I just find cheap ones on Amazon and I replace them often and that's okay because they're super cheap. They're like $6, so it's not a big deal, but I'll show that to you in a second. Go check out my purse really quick. I did a little whole, you know, showing you of my purse and then come back because we're gonna go through and go through my old purse and transfer it to the new purse. But I'm also watching out the window for the UPS truck to bring a second Amazon shipment. It literally is due here within 20 minutes. It says it's in route and I know he's probably just in the neighborhood circling around getting everything out. He's probably gonna laugh. He's already been here today. <laughs> so anyway, go check out my purse. Here's a little sneak peek. Um, and, and then come right back. Then I'm gonna get my old purse and we're going to transfer it. Also have a few things in that second Amazon shipment that I need for this new purse and to like organize it. So I'm so excited. I don't know why I get so excited about a new purse. I'm getting my new, my old purse right now. I just kind of get bored with them and I don't, know, I don't know. Also, I'm sending my sister a cute little fun thing. I wanted to get to her before she went to Metco, but I think she's leaving in like two days. I won't get to her in time, so I just wanted to send that to her. It'll be there ready and waiting for her when she's back from her trip. So I need to go out to the, at least the mailbox here and mail that for her. But I also need to go to get melatonin at Target, but it's like, that's really tough tempting like to get one thing at Target. It's like going to Costco to get one thing. So I kind of need to wait and do that when I really only have time to do the one thing. <laughs> I have to trick myself. Go in, get out, you know, so I don't buy anything else. You'll be proud. I haven't bought anything at the dollar spot for weeks. I don't buy any decorations. I don't buy trinkets. I don't buy anything. I really haven't. I've done well. Okay, come right back. Miss you so bad, won't you come back to me? I've got you in my head, you're all that I see. I've lost all my chances, I know that I am too late. I'm thinking of you, I'm thinking of you, I'm thinking of you. Wondering if you're thinking about me too. Now it's too late, now it's too late. I'm out of time, but I'm still thinking of you My heart keeps on bleeding, I have scars, the ones that healing They're all there because of you Alright, we're going to sit by the fire as we enjoy my new purse. Look how pretty she is. Now, if you have been here with me for a while, like more than a couple years, more than a yeah, more than two years. Let me know if this purse looks familiar because I used to have a yellow one. In fact, some of you have asked me for a direct link to this purse in the past and I've sent it to you and I got it again because I really realized I loved it. I love these outside pockets for my cell phone and then I put my chapstick in the other one. Like I already know what goes in each pocket. <laughs> Anyway, and the, my favorite feature in the purse is having this dual pocket inside. I'll show you why that I like that here as we get it organized with the new stuff in it. I just, I love having two compartments in here. I'm very excited to get done with this purse. I'll just donate it. I don't need to keep it. And then we'll put everything into the new purse. But I also got this new phone case. Look how cute she is with my new purse. I love the colors. I haven't actually done a pink case for, I don't even know that I ever have, but I really liked it. It's kind of see-through. You can see the white phone underneath it, but it has this little slider that I love now instead of a ring. I love this little feature here. All right, so let me show you how that works. You just slide your finger in that way and then you can hold it. I'll get my things off the screen there. Anyway, so then it doesn't fall off. You don't drop your phone, right, that. But then it's also a little stand, so you can actually 
like prop it up and my other one that I had it did have a stand on it but it was really difficult to like maneuver it and this one is just like super easy I can actually just push that down and then slide it back up to use it so I quite like my new case it's kind of fun again they're like six dollars so it's not that big a deal all right, so first step with the old purse is to empty it out and see what, what I have in my purse. We have keys and I have a cute little pack of mints. Now that we have no masks, mints are kind of a thing. We need to make sure we have good breath. I've got my keys and my P.O. Box key. I heard through the grapevine that I might have a package at the post office in a day or two. Okay, second pocket. What do I have in here? A beverage straw. Mm, I might need to go get myself a beverage. <laughs> that sounds really good. All right, what do we have in here? We have one pouch, two pouches, and a wallet, my battery case, and my gosh, can't believe I'm showing you the pit of my purse. Can you guys even see down in there? Woo! -hoo! All right, that's pleasant. That's a true women's purse right there right okay let's see what we pull out i don't even know when these were put in there wow that's <laughs> what else is in here okay more what else is in there then it's just crumbs okay what is in this one i don't know i don't oh, okay that felt like really strange okay there's more junk more whoop that was something that was something oh gum Oh, another beverage straw. I don't know why I end up with extras. They don't ever give me extras. Scrunchy, uh, candy, and a mint. That's it. This purse is done. Let's see what the mess is. I really like don't normally have such a mess in my purse. This is actually kind of surprising to me. Um, I snagged these at a local bathroom because <laughs> I wasn't sure and I knew I didn't have any extras in here and I was like, I don't know what's going to happen the next day or two. I'm just going to grab these just in case. Anyway, so we've got a few things that I just need to reorganize. I do keep a mask in here because every once in a while, either I feel like I need to wear it with the crowd or it a place does require it still like at the scan place. So we're gonna go through this kind of stuff and organize it. And then I'll show you why I like to have the two compartments and it has to do with this guy right here. All right, so I'll probably just set these candies out on the counter for one of the kids to eat. The mints are staying with me. This uh, chocolate, I don't eat them on the road. Like, I don't I don't know, I don't eat candy like that on the road. So I'm probably just gonna set that on the counter. My keys will go into the outside pocket. Then a lot of this stuff right here is what I would normally put into like my little, you know, ditty bag, my little toiletry bag. But I feel like I need to go through this and, I'm, cause I'm gonna change. I have some more stuff coming in the Amazon haul that is gonna change this pocket as well. So. Let's see what's in here. I, I do use a lot of this stuff, so let's just see if I need it still. Okay, we've got some scrunchies and um, hair bands here. I've got my fan. I've got pen, a tripod, and a Sharpie. This is actually a screwdriver. It has four different heads that are contained inside, and then you just unscrew this top here and put it in there. And so that actually is quite handy. I wish I had a pocket knife. So anyway, but I have a screwdriver and I've got three combs. I'm not sure why I have three. So I'm gonna pick the one I think would work best and put the others back. So I'll keep one with me. That comes in handy at church for the girl's hair when they kind of forget to get the last of the tangles out. Meclizine, this is coming with us. When does it expire? Oh, it expired in December. I don't know. I think it's gonna be fine, but I, cause I have a lot in here and I don't wanna, look at that. I have a lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and use those. It's only three months past and I don't really think it's like that expired. We will be using this a lot on our trip to Hawaii, both on the plane and on the drives. It's like a two hour drive to all three areas that we're gonna go to with it on the island. So I just think we're gonna need that for road trips. I've got a whole pile of mints. I've got sanitizer, uh, lighter. I don't know why I would need that in my purse. I don't know. It's like the screwdriver. When do I need it? But then when you need it, you're like, oh, I'm so glad I have it. And then I've got some Tylenol. Again, I need, do need those. I've got my secret stash of tweezers. I don't tell anyone that I have these. This stays with me. Again, mints. And then I have a mask. And then I think we're gonna have to use these little clippies on our trip as well, because the TSA mask requirement ends the day we come home. <laughs> so we will have to wear a mask on the plane. Totally fine. We'll probably wear it coming home as well. But these work really handy when you kind of clip it to the earpiece right here and then if you do take it off then it stays attached to you I don't worry about that when I'm around town but it's really really handy when you're traveling so I'm gonna keep that with me all right all of these things are organized I've got all these little toiletry items back into this bag and then I've just got all the stuff that will go into individual pockets within the purse and that's all done then I've got my wallet here obviously I'm not gonna show you 
a ton of detail in my wallet. I do have one little coupon that I might use at Bath and Body Works. I might try and see if they have a travel size lotion for my purse because, where is it? This little Waikiki Beach, uh, yeah, Waikiki Beach Coconut Lotion is gone. I've gotten every ounce of it out of this. So I would love to have one to travel with, but I do have a large one that I'm taking with us. So, but again, like I wanna have it just like regular around town. So I might try and use that coupon to get another little one. Um, I've got three straws, candies. These are all things that I don't need in my purse anymore. I literally don't even use any kind of lip gloss or lipstick or anything. So I don't know, I'll just get rid of those. And then I do have, um, my regular stuff in here. I've got a mask um, just in case I need it. It's like one of those medical ones. And I do have some cash in here because we're going to get our nails done and this helps me stay on check. So I have made appointments for me and Kaylee and Abby to go get our nails done for this trip. And I just want to make sure that I, sometimes I like feel pressured to tip more or, and I tip 20%, but I get more pressure like when I'm there. And so if I have cash, I'm like, no, this is exactly what I'm paying. I'm not paying more. And so I've got the cash. Plus I think Kaylee and Abby are going separate than me. Just because of school and timing, we couldn't all go at the same time. And she has, Kaylee has her SATs like, the last day that she can go and get her nails done. So I didn't want her to go before the SAT. I want her to go and relax and be done with school and ready for the trip. So I've got that cash in there. So now what I'm gonna show you is this bag. Actually, I can't really show you a ton of stuff that's in here. It's, it, this is all of our insurance cards and I keep them on a ring. I'm just gonna briefly show you. It's on a little key ring. They're all on a ring and they're all attached together. This is all of the kids and I have that in there and I also have extra, I don't even know. These are all gift cards. So you can see these ones. These are gift cards that have balances on them. Jason and I have actually tried to like go through and use them on like dates and stuff, but there's still balances on these guys. So I have those in there. Then I also have, I don't know, I should just, I could take these out. These are business cards, but I always forget that I have them in here and I don't hand them out to friends if they're looking for the address. Um, but anyway, I could go through it and get it. See, there's another comb. I don't need like five combs in here. These are like all the membership cards. My library card, Ikea. Really, Beth, or like, what is this one? This is a Build-A-Bear. Like I don't need Build-A-Bear. That's the jeweler where I got my ring from. I don't need my ax, I don't know. I might go through this one and kind of get rid of some of those. But this stays in my purse all the time. But if you can tell, it's like too big. Like, and so then it's just bulky and in the way. And that's why I want two compartments. I'm gonna get a smaller pouch for this and kind of declutter it and kind of make it smaller. But that's what's gonna go into the second pouch in my purse. Out, tucked out of the way, but if you've been with us, you know how often we've been going to the doctor, the ER, and the urgent care with Ashley. <laughs> So it comes in handy to just have it right on hand. I don't have to stress about it, especially if we're out and about and someone gets hurt. We just go straight to the hospital and have all the insurance cards with me. Uh, it's just something that I've always done. I always see people when they get to the hospital and they're like, well, I don't have my insurance card. I'm like, why wouldn't you have that with you? That's like a driver's license. That's something you should have on your body no matter what happens. So I'm gonna go through that. I'm not gonna show you that because I'm not gonna give away all my card information and whatnot. I did find two more receipts that I can upload. So maybe I'll get closer to to that $20 gift card. If you haven't done the fetch, please give my, give a girl 4,000 points and it'll give yourself a bonus as well. Okay, so I'm gonna organize a little bit more here and then we'll start putting stuff into the purse. Okay, he did not knock on my door and I did not hear the UPS truck, but I just checked and my Amazon is here. Okay, let me show you what else I got. This is like literal perfect timing. I could not have planned that better. Okay, let me show you what's in here. Some of it I can't show you because some of it's for birthdays, like I said, but I can show you some of it. Okay, just a small hint. There's green. That's a birthday. You can see there's balloons, but I'm not going to give you the other clue. It's on the other side of it. So there's one thing and here's another thing, but I'm not going to give it away what is in this little tubular package here. Okay, this one is not for my purse, but do you guys know what this is? Just with looking at it right here, can you tell what this would be? Can you, I told this about to Abby yesterday that I got this and she's like, wait, what? And then I explained it to her and she's like, oh, that will be really handy. It's chub rub. <laughs> It's a body glide um, for chafing. And when you haven't worn a swimsuit uh, for a good six months to a year, then your inner thighs get a little sore. And anyway, there's four girls and me could make use of this. So I wanted to test it in Hawaii. It's just like a little deodorant stick like that. I figured we could just wipe it with a towel, like a little napkin or whatever in between each of us using it. This is like eight bucks, but I do know that at least two of my daughters do get little skin rashes um, from their skin rubbing. So especially 
when we first start out on these kinds of trips. For whatever reason, it doesn't happen this summer because we're not in a swimsuit every single day. It usually just happens on vacation. So I'm gonna put that in my travel stuff. I don't think I'm gonna put it in here because I think I'm gonna need that with the travel stuff. Like I'll put it with the sunscreen. Okay, so then I got these cute little pouches and there's three of them in here and that's what I wanna use the, for the toiletry stuff and then like card information. So I'm gonna pull these out and kind of organize these. Didn't realize there's four. There's four of them in here. So I'm just gonna try and figure out like certain things are in certain pouches so that I can just pull them out when I need that item. Um, but I gotta try and make it make sense. I don't know if it's gonna make sense to have these in separate pouches, but we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna hang on to this guy and see if I wanna keep it and use it later. I don't know, we'll just kinda play with by ear. I've got mints, sanitizer, and medicines in this pouch and get that closed up. Then this one has like the tools. I've got pens and the lighter and the little screwdriver. I've got all of those in there. And then feminine stuff. I've got my scrunchies and hairbands and tampons in here. I probably will add a few more <laughs> to that supply. There's plenty of room for a few more. Plus I have smaller ones than that. And then I've got my cards in here. I did condense these ones down and I'm not putting Jason's business cards in here. I just, I'm not handing them out. So I'm going to give those back to him. And I did declutter a bunch of my gift cards. Like they just are done and used. Of course I have McDonald's ones <laughs> and there's no justice here anymore. And I don't like their style anyway. I've got all of these. Now let's start packing up the purse back all here. Right, so let's take you on a little tour of my purse. It's like a hotel tour or a, an empty house tour. This is a full purse tour. Okay, you ready? <laughs> I know this is so exciting for you guys. I have my keys in here and Abby always gets on me uh, that I need to tuck this in and actually zip it up. People don't need to know that my key is in there so that they can't grab it out. Or she's right. So that tucks there. Then these pockets are going to be for my phone. I like to stick the phone down in there or if I have little things that I get along the way, I can put them right into there instead of like making a mess inside the purse. Then I also have one empty pocket right here and then inside in the main pouch, all I have in this main pouch is my wallet, my chapstick ball. I keep that right in this inside pocket where I can get to it, I can see it, I can feel it. And then you can see down here is my little battery case right down here. And it sits down on the bottom because then my camera, but you guys, this right here, I always need to have a spot for the camera to go. And I'm gonna show you how you fit into here. It just goes nice, tucks into that, into that little spot right there. And this little pack here will keep my wallet pushed over over and create an empty spot for that camera all the time. I take my camera with me everywhere I go. I need to have a spot that's open all the time and I always like to have my wallet open. So I don't like anything to be on top of it inside the purse, which is why that second pouch, see look, this second pouch is really handy. I can zip this completely closed and have all of this stuff completely separate. And then I know I can just pull out these little pouches when I need them, but they're tucked away when I don't. So I have all of those purses down in here. I think I'm gonna really like having them separate like that. There is one little pocket on the back of the purse, but I don't think I'm gonna use it. Less is more, right? Don't need to fill it all up. But I like these chunky handles on the top. I do like to hold the purse like that, especially to get out to the car. But then I also like to have a shoulder strap. I just, I love to have a shoulder strap. And I do like it long, so in case I wanna like do it over my body as well, like cross shoulder. If I'm in public and I really wanna make sure I keep this purse on my body and I'm worried about it being stolen, I will put this as a cross body. And so I just lengthen this strap here. Otherwise I just keep it at shoulder length so that my fingers can fit down into this pocket and drop my phone in or grab my wallet or whatever. There is my purse. I'm very excited to have it and have it all ready to go. I think that's gonna do it for me today, you guys. This little uh, purse overhaul. And I think I'm gonna end it with you guys. It was a little chit chatty. You kind of get an, a sense of me if you are new. So go ahead and subscribe if you are new. If you are not, let me know if you have seen the yellow purse. Let, let me know if you've been here long enough. I know some of you have. <laughs> let me know if you remember the yellow purse. Let me know if you were the person who asked me for the link to that purse years ago and if you did end up getting it and if you did end up liking it. I would really love to know that because clearly I like the purse because I come back for a second time. But anyway, that was kind of a fun little purse Amazon haul. Perfectly timed today. So take care and come back for more. We are, we are so close to Hawaii. You heard me talk about Hawaii a lot. If you are new, we're going. We're going very soon. Obviously I can't tell you specifically when, that's for our safety purposes, but we are going soon. So you'll want to stick around, click on that bell and you'll get notified of when videos come out and the subscribe button will also notify you of when a video will post. Five days a week, Monday through Friday, but there's going to be bonus videos like every day of the week and sometimes two or three times a day. Yes, there's gonna be a lot of videos coming out so you'll want to come back for more. Take care and see you next time. Bye guys.